this one that's rapping. Oh my God, oh my God, if I die, I'm a legend when they lay me down. Yo, what is on everyone? My name is Nathan. Welcome back to another video. Real quick, I want to apologize for not making a more entertaining video. I don't have a membership right now, so I was gonna stream, but you know, I don't have a membership. So if you guys want to see some streams, make sure to drop a like on today's video. If this video gets 65 likes, then I will definitely stream maybe tomorrow. I'll definitely stream probably tomorrow, so if you guys can get this video to 65 likes, then I'll stream tomorrow. But anyway, what is going on everyone? My name is Nathan, I think I already said that, but in today's video, I'm just going to be going over my life deck setup because I know a lot of people, they want to do life PvP and they don't know like what their deck setup should look like. And I know I went through this in like another video, but like not really well, so I'm going to show you guys my entire deck setup and some of my gear stats, so let's go over it. So let's go to my main deck. Right here we have four tower shields. I would definitely recommend learning tower shields. You always want to be more defensive when you're life. I also have three volcanic shields. You get this when you train up two tower shields. I also have three legend shields, three life blades, four luminous weavers. Now I know not everyone's going to have luminous weaver, but if you do have it, they're really helpful. If you don't, then I guess you could find something to, you know, substitute in for luminous weaver. I also have three sprite guardians. They're really helpful because they can heal you. And they're just so OP. They also piss a lot of people off. So you guys want to, you know, troll some people, then definitely put these in. I have one Nature's Wrath for if you want to, you know, get rid of some minions. I have four fairies and I have four satyrs because you just want to have a bunch of heals when you're life because, you know, you can't really hit. So you always want to have a couple heals. I also have three seraphs, two spirit armors, and then three Keeper of the Flame. I know, like I said, not everyone's going to have Keeper of the Flame or Luminous Weaver. So if you don't have it, then you can find something else to, you know, substitute in. I also have three weakness. Now, I would definitely recommend learning weakness and tower shield first because they're just so helpful. Especially weakness because you can just spam them and, you know, they're really helpful. So for down here, I have three storm wands, three life wands, a life blade, and then a unicorn. So if you guys want to, you know, pause the video, take a screenshot, take a picture, whatever you got to do, uh, then do that. So for my treasure cards, I have two tower shields. Like I said, you always want to be kind of defensive. I also have two monsters for enchanted, you know, luminous weaver if I have to, or keeper of the flame. I have one enchanted seraph. I have one myth blade. I have an orthrus. I have a shatter. I have a shift because you're all you are uh, almost magus, and you go a lot of or you go against a lot of people that have like you know overtime spells, so that's really helpful. I have one infallible, one reshuffle because you know reshuffle is always good to have just in case. And then I have one spirit blade. And you're like Nathan, why do you have myth hits? Well, basically, I have the Myth Mastery Amulet, which is very helpful. If you're life, you definitely want to have this so you can have something you to use to like actually hit because life, you don't get that many hits. So definitely recommend having a Mastery. I also have Storm Mastery, too, if you want to, you know, use something with Storm. But I'm going to stick to the Myth Mastery since I have Keeper of the Flame Learned. So for my gear, real quick, I just have the whole Jade set. Jade is really good for life because it boosts your healing a lot and it gives you extra health. So you always want to have like extra, you know, incoming and outgoing. For my boots, yeah, jade boots. For my wand, I have the Aquilin, Aquilin Valite Lance, however you say that. I really don't know. It gives 2% pierce, 1% life damage, May Cast Queen Calypso. It's really good. I also have these wands, but, you know, I'm gonna, I like the May Cast better. I could use this since I have, you know, Myth Mastery, and it might help a little bit, plus it'll give me 1% incoming, but I'm probably just gonna stick, or, you know, the Mana Burn one, that's pretty good too, but I'm probably just gonna stick with this one. I mean, it's only level 10. If I got the level 21, then I'd definitely rock that one, but I only had the level 10 one for now. So for the Athame, I have the Duelist Fatal Razor. Definitely recommend getting that. If you don't have that, then maybe use the Hard Steel. For my Amulets, I have the Myth Master Amulet, like I said. For my Rings, I have the Duelist Daredevil Ring, you know, the PvP Ring. Definitely would try to get that. If you can't, then, you know, you could probably find one. I think I used this one before I got it, so... Anything that boosts your, you know, health and healing, I would definitely recommend. For my pet, you know, it really depends. This pet isn't the best, but it gives me 10% resist, may cast fortify, may cast fairy, and then plus 6% life damage. Still gotta train it to mega. I don't know if I'm going to because I'm kind of scared of what it might get. And then I have a 4% incoming socket or jewel on that pet, you know, just to boost the incoming. Because when you're life, that's basically what you want to try to, you know, try to do, so... I have 19% damage to life, 29 resist to everything, 11% incoming, and then 13% outgoing. I could get like 20 and 20 if I really tried, but you know, 
I'm just gonna stick with that. But yeah, that's basically my life deck setup. I hope this video helped you guys out. If it did, make sure to drop a like. Like I said at the beginning of the video, if you guys want to see a stream tomorrow, make sure you smash that like button and we gotta get 65 likes. So I hope you guys have a great rest of your day. My name is Nathan and I'll catch you guys in the next video. Peace.